Tessa McVeigh to Slice Show Jessica and today I am here to do the Monkeys Awards Challenge that Alex did a few weeks ago and this circulated around Tumblr two years ago and I remember participating and yeah. So I thought I would do it as a Woha Club video right now. If any other Woha Club members want to do it, you totally should. I'll be putting questions in the description below. If any of you guys want to do it, feel free to jump in. Question number one, favorite song written by a monkey. At the moment, by Michael, it would have to be Annie's Municipal Court. For Mickey, it would have to be Mommy and Daddy. Davy, you and I. And for Peter, it would have to be, do I have to do this all over again? Question two, favorite romp. So, my favorite romp, it would have to be Saturday's Child, because it's adorable, them playing with children. It's so sweet. Or Papa Jean's Blues, because at 1.48, uh, you will not be disappointed. But there's also parts of Valley Sunday. Really nice romp. Three, how and when did you get into the monkeys? I got into the monkeys back in June 2016, and YouTube recommended me a full monkeys episode, and that was Sun Like It Was Warm. And after listening to the song The Door in the Summer, I just kind of, you know, wanted to look more into their music. Because I had heard of the show and I had, you know, listened to the greatest hits. So after listening to a lesser known monkey song, I kind of went, I should probably get more into them. So, yeah. Four, favorite album. My favorite album has not changed in the past two, two and a half years, two years. So, it's still Pisces, Crows, Capricorn, and Jones. But I do also like, um, Present and Headquarters and Birds, Bees, and the Monkeys, like, those are kind of like my main albums. Favorite song off of Good Times. So off of Good Times, I really, I like almost every song on that album. But if I had to pick one favorite, it would probably be Wasn't Born to Follow. Because, you know, Carol Kane, really nice song. I love it so much. Monkey with the best hair. Monkey with the best hair. I'm going to have to say Michael. I know I sound very biased, and I know Mickey had like the best afro ever. And like, like. 1967, 68, and onward. <laughs> but Michael in the long run, like when his hair was a little bit long and he had to wear a hat, wear his knitted wool hat as a, you know, bang out of eyes kind of thing. And just when it got a little bit shorter, and you know, just Michael had like the best hair overall in the 60s. <laughs> Favorite Mike and Mickey Harmony. It would have to be Annie's Municipal Court, because they have some really nice harmonies. And I'm talking about the Birds, Bees, and the Monkeys um, version. Favorite episode, pick three. So my three favorite episodes would have to be Monkeys Out of Mode, because I plan to major in journalism. So um, yeah, that, uh, that episode I love a lot. Fairy Tale, because who doesn't love Fairy Tale? It's a great, great episode. And Frodo's Caper, because not a lot of people like the Frodo's Caper, but I really do. Like, it's a nice, it's a very nice episode. It's weird, but I love it. Favorite monkey. Y'all know me. My favorite monkey has not changed at all in the past two years that I've been a monkey fan. And it's Michael. Just, Michael is so, so talented, and, you know, he wrote the greatest music you've ever heard with, you know, the Monkees and the First National Band, Second National Band, and Post, you know, groups. You know, he's just so amazing. Like, honestly, I love him so, so much. Favorite TV moment. My favorite TV moment would have to be, um, oh, there are just so many. It's like, fairy tale where Peter's, like, asking Michael and Mary or Princess Gwen to marry him, and Prin Princess Gwen's like, no, I won't marry you. you know, it's adorable. Favorite story in Monkey's history. My favorite story in Monkey's history would have to be the um, party the Beatles threw for the Monkeys because just the thought of seeing my two favorite groups in the same room makes my heart sing. Favorite post-episode interview. Alex, the name that Michael tapes to his chair is Lauren St. David, and that one would have to be my favorite as well. Which monkey was the best actor? I would have to go for Peter, because Michael is playing a more 
amped out version of himself, you know, like a more optimistic per version of himself. Whereas Mickey and Davy don't change at all whatsoever. But Peter, he just plays a totally different character from himself and, you know, which make which to me makes him the best actor. <sighs> Ultimate favorite, Monkey Songs pick three. Annie's Municipal Court, which is Michael's version with him singing lead that is on the Birds, Bees, and the Monkeys rarities. Um, your Auntie Griselda, because it's adorable as all hell, because Peter is just adorable as all hell. And there's also I'll Be Back Upon My Feet, because you know, it's just a nice song. It's a really nice song. That was probably going to change the next day. So yeah, those three songs are not set in stone. <laughs> Alright. And finally, number 15, what do the monkeys mean to you? Because I don't want to make this a one hour long video. I'm going to keep it short and simple. The monkeys, they opened so many doors to me within like American pop culture of the 1960s because my heart totally belonged to the British Invasion when I was like between the ages of 12 to 16. So, you know, I had, you know, my I loved the British Invasion so much until I got into the Monkees. Then I started getting into more American bands and just started, you know, branching out to, you know, different genres of music. I never thought I'd call myself a country girl, but I love the first national band oh so much. You know, it's so cool. You know, it's just the monkeys open a lot of doors, you know, within my music taste, and I just appreciate it oh so much. And my dad keeps telling me this, that my music taste will change when I'm in college, and I hope that my heart will still belong to the amazing music that I'm into right now. So yeah, I just have to thank the monkeys for bringing me so much happiness and just making me so freaking happy and amazing. And without the monkeys, this channel wouldn't have happened, of course, and we I wouldn't be able to know I wouldn't have gotten to know so so many amazing people like the members of this channel, Michael, Alex, um, <laughs> Lily, Max, and Kirsten, and just everyone that was on the channel in the past, and you guys who watch our videos, you know, just that's all thanks to the monkeys, you know, it's amazing. And I appreciate everything that, you know, came with being a part of this month, this fandom. And, you know, I just appreciate everything. So, that is the end of my video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And if any of the other Volha Club members want to do this tag, I will put questions in the description below. And if any of you guys want to do it, let me know, in the, you know, Paste your answers in, in the comment section below or even do a video response. So, yeah. I will see you all next week. Bye.